Akira Yoshino, one of three recipients of this year's Nobel Prize in Chemistry, spoke of the difficulties in developing lithium-ion batteries. The honorary fellow at Asahikase Corporation won the prize along with John Goodenough of the University of Texas at Austin and Stanley Whittingham of Binghamton University. They were recognized Wednesday for developing lithium-ion batteries and thus creating a rechargeable world. Yoshino created the first commercially viable lithium-ion battery in 1985. The batteries are now widely used in smartphones and laptop computers, but things did not look quite promising at first. Yoshino told a press conference in Tokyo that researchers in general have a hard time in the stages of basic and development research. He said new products may not be immediately accepted by markets. That was also the case for lithium-ion batteries, which did not sell well for the first three years. The Japanese chemist said he was under a lot of pressure considering the money spent on developing the new type of batteries. But in 1995, when Windows 95 came out, lithium-ion batteries started selling like hotcakes. Yoshino noted that while the Nobel Committee has chosen three laureates this time, there are many other scientists involved in the development of lithium-ion batteries.